生まれながらの負け犬くんそいつは負け犬じゃねえ明日は俺のライバルだ今、海を倒すなんなんだその振りもあるわ五枚目悪魔が強い Guys, welcome back to my reaction channel. Today, we're going to react to Black Clover episode 23. Now, guys, the last episode, we're still fighting the zombie guy, which I would say is impressive because he's managing to like rage a bell against everybody at the same time because of all the zombies. Sure, he probably had some prep time with the zombies, but bro, he just keeps pulling rabbits out of the hat, bro. Now he has. Zombies with magic abilities, and he just pulled a, a guy that can do like magic, like electricity magic, right? Thunder magic, right? So, yeah, it's a good thing we have Asta there because he's a literal, like, my man is the opposite of a magic knight, okay? Because he can just neutralize your magic, right? So, he's really a bad matchup for every single magic knight in this kingdom. <laughs> So I think we are definitely gonna defeat this guy, but he he's impressive that he's holding on as as like as as much as he is, right? Because there are actual Magic Knight captains on the battlefield, and still he's managing to push us away. But that being said, I ain't gonna pull on this that much. If you enjoy my reactions, you know what to do. Let's go. Okay, we're skipping the intro, and let's go. Yeah, look at like the whole. Palace is in ruins. What are they after? They just keep coming, though. Yeah, what the are they after? What? I, I feel like these zombies and this guy, they're just a distraction because we saw those guys that teleported. They, they were. Like, they were wearing the same wardrobe, like those guys that sacrificed themselves in that village for. Somebody more sinister, and they showed us the emblem of the Golden Dawns, right? So somebody, th this is gonna be an inside job, and the, all of that is a distraction. And the Wizard King disappeared, right? To he went to check up on something, and, and he's nowhere to be found. I think he's onto it this. Isn't the Wizard King himself here? These are the gravest of circumstances. He should have run immediately to my side at the first hint that the capital was being threatened. Okay, so is this like uh, in Naruto, right? You have the Kage, and then you have these guys, right? But uh, apparently here, there's only one royal royal. I, uh, I think when they explained about this whole thing, they said that there's a king, like somebody above even the Wizard King. And and it's going to be similar to Naruto's dynamic, right? With uh, feudal lords and all that. So this is basically a feudal lord. <laughs> Arrogant pop. Sometimes what? he seems to forget that this kingdom has but one ruler. Augustus Kira Clover is king here, not Julius Novo Chrono. Shut the hell up. You wouldn't even have a kingdom without the Wizard King. And also, why do they always portray these feudal lords like complete morons? I'm sorry. The only time I actually saw a feudal lord being j done justice was in Boruto when he visited Naruto, right? Like in OG Naruto and Shippuden, they would... They would they would always be like fat and just not interested in anything. They, they just have money and like that, they don't care, right? And this guy, again, he's acting like a toddler. Like, oh, it's all about me. It's all about me, brah. What about the people? They're literally dying right now. What are you still doing here, chef? Where did this little shortcake come from? <laughs> you mentioned a special entree, chef. Huh? I knew it. I'll make you a dish that will ruin you for all other food. You can't be serious, <laughs> sir. <laughs> we don't have time for this. We'll die. I'm not afraid of death. Life is life. Cooking is all. Okay, I know where that was inspired from. You know that chef that does that, that embarrassed himself in the World Cup? And he can do long range attacks. <laughs> Did you really think that would work? He's not going to stand still just because you asked him to, you idiot. I'll get one or two hits in for you while I'm at it. Yeah, yeah, he could do long range attacks too because that other sword siphoned 
her magic ability and then he could shoot it from the sword so yeah that other sword is a long range attack weapon bro also a way to combat a long range distance fighter is to attack the main guy if he attacks the main guy that corpse that flying corpse isn't going to be able to attack because it might hit the main guy so you hit two birds with one stone i may not have any magic power but what i do have are my friends Basta. that wound he got earlier looks bad it's spreading I just have to sit back and watch. I not only have a brain, but I know how to use it. So basically, he just admitted that he's weak. He just has strong magic abilities. They can, like, summon these zombies to protect him. But if you attack the main body and somehow get through, my man's probably gonna be one shot. <laughs> idiot! <laughs> yeah, you have your own problems to worry about. Whoa! Is it a squad captain? Or the kid? No! Impossible! I interfered in your fight. It was necessary. I'm sorry. Huh. I thought it a pity for a magic knight of your caliber to die here. Earlier, you said you planned to become the Wizard King. Bold statement. Say what? Seems that I am your rival as well. <laughs> oh, he wants to be the Wizard King. This guy doesn't seem scared. What is going on? No, you can't. <laughs> You're gonna get in the like way. I wasn't already hurt enough. Exactly. A warrior must always be aware of his body's condition. Tell me, what is the purpose of this attack? Your actions are too inconsistent for this to be a true invasion. Yeah, he mentioned it. He was... Like, he, he he took the exam, right? And probably nobody raised their arms and he wasn't ex accepted in the Ma Magic Knight squads, bro. But, yeah, this guy was definitely here in front of these captains. That's why he knows all of them and he's strong. But like I said in the previous reaction, I can understand nobody wanting to work with him because his magic is zombie magic. Literally bringing people, like, deceased people back to life and using their corpses to f do the battles for him. It's kind of immoral, and thus, I don't know, bro, right? It's kind of, uh, I, don't, I don't know, right? But, uh, yeah, he definitely knows the captains and this whole kingdom because he once tried to join them. And you guys pointed out the difference between nobles and royals, right? So, this guy, like, this honorable captain here, they just honored Asta with his words. I think he's a royal, like, from a royal lineage, but the nobles, they, they just have a lot of money. They don't have the titles. Like, they, they just have a lot, a lot of money, right? So that's the difference. I think this guy is from a royal bloodline, right? Just like the Silva guys, right? The Noel brother and brothers, I guess, his, their whole family. But yeah, I think uh, you guys explained well. Let's go. Though it's a shame I'm the only one enjoying this reunion. What's that? <laughs> I was a magic knight, inducted six years ago as a top candidate. Your name? Pfft, the name's Radies. Radies, <laughs> that's right. You were chosen by the Purple Orcas, so why are you fighting against us now? Because those short-sighted fools kicked me out. There you have it, Captain. I'm here to use my cursed power to get revenge on the magic knights and the kingdom that rejected me. Don't toy with me, you fool! Yeah, yeah, like, I don't know whether he said it or somebody else said it, but th that's one of the purposes. Definitely, there's something personal going on here, but there's something more deeper going on with the Golden Dawns and that mysterious guy from the Golden Dawn. This is going to be an inside job. This is a distraction, I'm telling you. You doubt me? <laughs> that's the thing about reasons. They're usually quite simple. Their magics are too mismatched for a decent fight. Not that I was going to let you help. They're on their own. Oh. Ooh, a fire That's line. Time to fight. With a dash of my curse powers thrown in, we're practically impervious. Jeez, That's another uh... one? How many does he have? Yeah. Uh, sir. Remember. Yo, my man must have dug half the kingdom to achieve all these corpses, bro. You know what I Damn. said before about staying calm. Fine. Let's see how well you hold up when we combine an ironclad defense with a rapid fire attack. 
Indeed, I appear to be quite helpless. <laughs> ah, is that all you've got? I have to say, Captain, I'm very disappointed in you. Yeah. You think I've never been up against that sort of attack before? Listen Yo. up, you two. You are Magic Knights. That's what it means to be a Magic Knight squad captain. Impressive. Man, he's awesome. <laughs> he so, is. It can't be. Mm. You're a monster. They were right to have expelled you. <laughs> Yo, my man kicked him while he's down. <laughs> I have a report, sire. Almost all of the assailants have now been neutralized. It's over. I'd still like to know what those things were. Mm. Whatever they were, I find it highly unlikely that they were our true enemy today. <laughs> Too bad. I hardly got to play at all. Something isn't right here. Uh -huh. <sighs> I guess it's all but over. The preparations must be nearly complete by now. Oh, here comes beast. trouble. Such lively young mana. Okay, here comes trouble. That guy was just a diversion. Looks like there's gonna be more pawns in this game and i'm telling you it's an inside job somebody's feeding them information they know exactly when and where to strike and all those people cheering the knights on are they all nobles you guys know they're all nobles they seem like commoners here but this is the royal palace so they should all be nobles right so that's very interesting that guy really impressed me the the right uh, knight captain the wizard knight captain yeah, my man really really spoke well with Asta about Asta right and he was the only one who stood up to that Silva guy who was getting ready to kill Asta right when they were fighting and they were about to fight and then this thing whole this whole thing happens so looks like the, these fiery brothers aren't half bad at all <laughs> and now I guess Asta has more rivals bro more than you know they, they all want to be wizard king which is dope, it's a dope motivation, you gotta admit. But listen, I can't wait to jump straight into the next one because I have a feeling this is not over by a long shot. That being said, I really enjoyed this episode, hope you enjoyed the reaction, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe, love you, enjoy, and bye.